Hey folks, your OS Reviews. Today we're checking out two silicon jacket sleeves to protect any iPod Video slash iPod Classic, which are becoming increasingly rare as we use more and more iPhones and iPod Touches, and so the older generation of hard drive-based digital music players is slowly becoming extinct. With that being said, people who still use it have a large amount of music they want to carry with them at all times, and to protect that, we have these pretty useful jackets. They sell for roughly 10 bucks online through Amazon.com for a pack of two, so they're not too expensive, and it offers a pretty thick layer of silicon as opposed to more cheaper counterparts that we've also seen. At a cosmetic glance, I thought that this was actually produced by uh, the same company that makes the one laptop per child, so I looked that up, but actually this is just a generic build, which I thought was a little bit strange. Uh, the quality of these silicone jackets seem to be pretty strong. As you can see here, you have access to some grips on the sides, which makes it easier for you to hold the iPod without having it drop. There's also a pretty thick portfolio, however, so this is definitely a relatively rugged silicone case. It adds a fair amount of bulk when you're traveling, and that is certainly something to consider. On the very top, you have access to all the ports and controls, such as for the mute switch, as well as the uh, 3.5mm headphone jack. And on the front, it leaves your display as well as the capacitive scroll wheel untouched, so you can still access it pretty easily. It's slightly recessed as well, so if you do place the iPod flush against the surface, it prevents any scratching from happening, and also doesn't make the iPod slide around onto any surface or desk. And down, down below here, we have the ports completely revealed, so that corresponds to the 30-pin dock connector. And this is one of the limitations for this particular case because it's pretty easy to have an iPod accidentally slide out if you're not careful. So if I kind of push a little bit or even shove it and move it around, you can see it's pretty easy to slide accidentally out. Uh, so perhaps in the second generation model, the company could consider adding some kind of flap. It certainly makes installation easier without a flap, but at the same time, it's not as secure as I would have wanted it to be. On the back, it also looks like there is a slot for some kind of belt clip, but actually that's just for decoration purposes. And so it's overall a pretty clean presentation across the board. It certainly feels rigid, and if you drop it, it will absorb quite a bit of shock. Again, it comes in multiple colors. This is a green version, as you can see here, and you can use your iPod with ease as you listen to music and also protect it. Uh, and so overall, the design is pretty compelling. There are a few limitations. Again, it adds a bit of bulk, and also it doesn't protect the bottom there as much. But overall, it's a decent option to consider if you still are using a iPod Classic or a iPod Video. So to learn more information about these silicone jacket sleeves, you can check out our article on our website. This has been our video first look here at OS Reviews.